Reflection on violence. Violence, the deliberate use of physical force or power, actual or in the form of a threat, directed against oneself, against another person. A group of individuals or a community that results in, or is highly likely to, bodily injury, death. Psychological trauma, developmental disabilities or various kinds of damage, definition of the World Health Organization, who. In my understanding, violence is an action with my rights without my consent, as well as a violation of my rights as a punishment for my freedoms. All people have two freedoms and four rights given to us from birth. Freedom of expression and opinion is inviolable. The right to dispose and use our property, health, the time allotted to us in this world and interaction with the people around. Actions with my property, health, time, the imposition of interaction without my consent is violence. The use of violence for my words and beliefs is violence. This type of violence is called crime or criminal violence. There are criminal people, there are criminal laws, states. Any committed criminal violence must be disclosed. Those who commit criminal violence must be punished without fail. Punishment is the use of violence. Violence as punishment is righteous violence. Example theft was committed. Criminal violence against property. The thief is caught and proven guilty. Righteous violence applied to the thief. His property is taken away from him to compensate for the damage to the injured party and the payment of legal costs. They also deprive him of the right to dispose of time and by interacting with him in jail. Righteous violence is the main foundation of a moral and ethical society, its strength and stable development. All the problems of modern society are in the confusion between criminal violence and righteous violence. Often criminal laws are made. Law enforcement practices, but no one is responsible for this criminal violence. The court makes a decision on which a government official begins to dispose of private property without consent. The justification for the criminal decision of the court is, well, it is for the good of the whole society. Nonsense and the judge and the official should be punished. Senators have created a law according to which for your words and beliefs you can be fined or imprisoned, this is a criminal law. All who took it, applied it should be punished. As you understand in modern society, such criminals are not brought to justice. This is the big problem. How to create a society of morality and ethics if those who become in power can commit crimes and not be held responsible for it. Another big problem is the monopolization of violence. There are the so-called structures of violence, the police, the army. A person is deprived of the opportunity for righteous violence. This means they are deprived of the opportunity to effectively protect their rights and freedoms. We humans can use righteous violence against those who commit criminal violence. Of course, after that, all these types of violence should be considered in court. Where was the righteous, where was the criminal violence? Commensurability of violence. Join a group of noble, moral people. Links in the description. Introduce your friends with this information. See you next time.